Well, Lara, Desiree's mom is organizing a search that will begin tomorrow morning here in this parking lot, 291 and Liberty Drive. Now, Patty Tam says she and her family will do anything they can to find Desiree. I got up in the morning to go to work and her and her sister were already gone. Patty says that was Monday morning, May 1st. The sister says Desi, as the family calls her, was with two men. Patty believes the wrong kind of company to keep. They were expecting Desi to show up at a friend's or home that night. Then the next day, all connections to Desiree went dark. The last text message received was at 5.14 a.m. on the 2nd. This is so not like her. Um, she hasn't been on Facebook. She hasn't any social media, nothing. Despite dropping out of high school, Patty says Desi had been doing well until just recently. Now her worst fear is about the motives of her daughter's newest friends. They've done something with her. I don't know what. I want to think positive. But it's been 10 days now and nobody has heard or seen her. I just want my daughter home. Liberty police are also deeply concerned. They want to hear from anyone who has any information about Desiree's disappearance. You can call them directly or the tips hotline. We're live in Liberty. Lara. And if you want to join the search for Desiree, it starts tomorrow morning at 930. You just go to the parking lot between Price Chopper and Sutherland's at 291 and Liberty Drive. Searchers then plan to go to southeast Kansas City to knock on doors, pass out flyers. Her family believes she may have been seen at a gas station at Bannister and Holmes. Right.